It was basically just like this forest in the backyard of this church with um, a bunch of vine maple and dug fir and things like that. Always the songs, we would always sing songs when we came down to the forest. I remember playing outside in the woods. Um, playing like imaginary games with my friends and uh, just running around and uh, just like pretending to be like animals. The, the kids that I went to school with, um, about seven of those families, we would have like summer camping trips. We were the wild kids and we've been camping and backpacking and we're still getting together. We get together a few times every year. I'm old because I'm going to get some vegetables today. There we go. <laughs> There's the lettuce. Woodhaven is special to me because it was like my very, just like the very start of like everything it seemed like kind of because I like mess, met my best friends here. So I did a two month long immersion with Trackers Northwest when we lived on uh, like 85 acres of cedar forest down in on the southern Oregon coast. I came away with like this feeling that everything in the earth went in circles. Everything you take out of your land needs to be put back into your land. I still like to play imaginative games outside. Our backyard is like a yard and then we have forest in it. I, I like to build forts with my friends and we'll play like witch games or like we're runaway maids or something like just imaginary stuff like that. I just feel like being outside and playing those games really influenced how I play outside now. What does it say? Can you write that? I, I just wish there was nature-based education for everyone. <laughs>